Hi, everybody. This is Danielle from Harrisburg Township Free Library, and it's Tuesday, which means it's pajama story time. So I hope you're in your comfy jammies. You have a comfy robe or sweater. You have some comfy slippers. You have a blanket or a stuffy or whatever it is that you like to bring to pajama story time. I hope you have that with you so that you're extra comfy. And let's get started with our pajama story time opening song. Ready? If you want to read a book, clap your hands. If you want to read a book, clap your hands. If you want to read a book, listen up and take a look. If you want to read a book, clap your hands. If you want to read a book, stomp your feet. Stomp, stomp. If you want to read a book, stomp your feet. Stomp, stomp. If you want to read a book, listen up and take a look. If you want to read a book, stomp your feet. If you want to read a book, say shh. If you want to read a book, say shh. If you want to read a book, listen up and take a look. If you want to read a book, say shh. Perfect. All right, so we're all comfy cozy. We had our song, and now we're ready for our first book, and that is Bedtime for Monsters. <laughs> this is by Ed Veer. Well, monsters go to bed too, right? So they need a bedtime. So this is Bedtime for Monsters. Okay. Do you ever wonder if somewhere not too far away there might be monsters? Dun, dun. Because supposing there are monsters, do you think that this monster, this guy right here, do you think this monster might be licking his lips and thinking about you? And if this monster is thinking about you, Maybe he's thinking about you in an eating you up kind of way. I hope not, because he's coming to find you right now. There he is on his bike. Ding, 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 ding. And as he bicycles bumpily through the dark and terrible forest, bump, bumpity, bump. Do you think he's smiling because he remembered to pack a knife and fork? Mm. And as he crosses the gloopy, sloopy swamp, gloop, gloop, shloop, do you think he's imagining just how good you'll taste all covered in ketchup? Yeah, if you like that kind of thing. Yeah. And as he tiptoes through thorns and thistles, scritch, scratch, ouch! Do you think he'll decide you'll taste even more delicious? Squished and then squashed onto hot buttered toast? Mmm, I like hot buttered toast. And at this very moment, as he climbs up the cold and snowy mountains, getting closer, and closer. Don't you think he'll be feeling very hungry indeed? You're not scared, are you? I hope not. Because if he is feeling very hungry indeed, while he searches high and low and up and down and in and out all over town, maybe you'll hear his big empty tummy rumbling and grumbling. And if you do hear a rumbling and grumbling, might you also hear a creak? As he starts to climb the stairs, creak, creak, creak. and as he opens your bedroom door, do you think he's licking his lips because he wants to gobble you up? Oh no, it's much worse than that. 
this monster once? A disgustingly sloppy goodnight kiss! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, kissy, 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 ooh, monster drool. Oh, because it's bedtime for monsters everywhere. Big ones like him and little ones like you. Did you really think he was going to eat you up? How silly. He wasn't going to eat you up. He just wanted a big sloppy bedtime kiss. Ooh, ooh. All right then. Well, hello, Miss Wilma. I see that you have come joined us for story time. I, um, am, I am in my cat Wilma's uh, frequent bedtime spot, so um, she doesn't seem to care that I am in her bedtime spot. She's just going to come up here and sleep anyway, so there, there she is. She's just going to take her spot. So, well, let's do a song. So I want to do the color song. So this song is a rhyming song. So I'm going to say a line. And then you have to say the color that matches with that last word. So it gets a little hard. I'm only going to do two verses, but I think you can do it. So call the, the colors out that rhyme when you think when you think of them. Okay, so this is the color song. It is by Song Drops. You can find it on YouTube, the full version. It's a lot of fun. I'm only doing the first two verses. Oh, we're going to this is the color song, come on and sing along. Even if you sing it wrong, sing it loud and sing it strong. At the end of every line, say the color that could rhyme. There's a few you might not know, it gets harder as you go. All right, so this is when you have to say the colors. I feel new when I see. What do you think, Wilma? Blue. I feel serene when I see green. I go to bed when I see red. I open the door hinge when I see. This is the color song, come on and sing along. Even if you sing it wrong, sing it loud and sing it strong. At the end of every line, say the color that could rhyme. There's a few you might not know, it gets harder as you go. Ready for the second verse? I feel delight when I see white. I feel mellow when I see Yellow, I have to burple when I see purple. I open the door hinge when I see. I open the door hinge when I see. I open the door hinge when I see orange. When I see orange. When I see orange. When I see orange. Not a lot of things rhyme with orange. Orange, door hinge. Door hinge, orange, yeah, you know, it works. It, it does, it does work. It might not seem like it, but yeah, it works, it works. So, how'd you do? Did you, did you guess the rhymes? Yeah? Excuse me. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so. Um, pardon the interruption, the cat there. She's old and she, um, you know, she gets what she wants. And, you know, she deserves it because she's old. Yeah, mm -hmm. Well, let's start with another book then. This is, well, okay, goodbye. Guess I'm interrupting her sleeping time too much there. This is Hug Machine by Scott Campbell. I know that we can all use some hugs right now. Whoa, here I come. I am the hug machine. I am very good at hugging. The best at hugging. No one can resist my unbelievable hugs. I am the hug machine. Mm -hmm. My hugs calm people down. They cheer them up. They make them go completely nuts. I am the hug machine. I hug everything I see. No one escapes the hug machine. So he's hugging a fire hydrant, a bench, a mailbox, a tree. No one escapes the hug machine. My hugs make the biggest feel small. The smallest feel big. Aww. 
I hug soft things, hard things, square things, long things. I am the hug machine. Oh, do you need a hug? <clears throat> I think you do. Hug accomplished. There's nothing the hug machine will not hug. Oh, well, what about that guy? Oh. oh, what about me? I'm so spiky. No one ever hugs me. Oh, that's sad. They are missing out. Look what he did. He got a mask and some oven mitts and some padding, and he just hugged that porcupine good. What about me? Surely I am too big for you to hug. The whale. It's a big hug. Of course not. Not for the hug machine. Look what he did. He got a ladder, climbed up on top of that whale, and just hugged him all the way down. People often ask what the hug machine eats to keep the hugging energy high. Well, the answer is pizza. The hug machine likes pizza very much. Do you guys like pizza? I'm sure some of you do. Refueled and ready for action. Hug, 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 Oh, the hug machine is exhausted. The hug machine can hug no more. Oh, why, yes, you may hug the hug machine. Hug machine is always open for business. The end. Hug machine! Hello, Wilma. Welcome back. Gonna try again to go back to sleep? Mm hmm. Well, I'm going to do another song, so that's probably going to disturb you. Yeah? So, well, just hold on for the ride there. Do you guys have your baby sharks with you? We haven't done baby shark for a little while. So, let me take a deep breath. Because <sighs> this song, you know, <sighs> you don't have breath for this song. Get out your baby sharks there. Got one. Got two. One or two. Baby sharks. Ready. End. Baby shark do 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 baby shark do 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 baby shark do 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 baby shark Mama shark do 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 Mama shark do 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 Mama shark do 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 Mama shark Daddy shark do 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 Daddy shark do 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 Daddy shark do 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 Daddy shark Grandma shark do 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 Grandma shark do 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 Grandma shark do 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 Grandma shark Grandpa shark do 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 Grandpa shark do 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 Grandpa shark do 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 Grandpa shark Going swimming do 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 Going swimming do 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 Going swimming do 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 Going swimming See a shark do 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 do. See a shark do 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 do. See a shark do 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 do. See a shark. Swimming fast do 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 do. Swimming fast do 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 do. Swimming fast do 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 do. Swimming fast. Save that last do 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 do. Save it last do 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 do. Save it last do 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 do. Save it last. Bye bye shark do 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 bye bye shark do 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 bye bye shark do 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 bye bye shark bye bye shark bye bye shark yeah whatever yeah yeah what can I say she's a cat she always you know she doesn't appreciate these kind of things yeah all right whew well since you guys are probably pretty exhausted from all that swimming let's do a nice calm. For our last book, let's do a nice calm book. This is I Am Peace, a book of mindfulness by Susan Baird and art by Peter Reynolds. I Am Peace. Hmm. 
see. There seems to be a little bit of a glare there that makes this harder to see. Try with this here. Okay. Let's try this. See if that helps. Try and piece. There we go. And maybe if I move a little closer, you can see this. There are times when I worry about what might happen next and what might happen before. The thoughts in my head are like rushing water and I feel like a boat with no anchor, being carried away, just like that. You ever feel like that sometimes? I give myself a moment, I take a deep breath, take a deep breath. And then I tell myself, it's all right. I feel the ground beneath my feet and steady myself. And start to notice that here and now, my thoughts begin to settle, my mind begins to clear, I am peace. I can watch my worries gently pop and disappear. I let things go. I can say what I feel inside and out. I can say what I feel inside out loud. I know myself. I can share kindness with others. I make a difference. So one of the seeds that he was feeding the bird dropped on the ground and grew into a tree. I can hug a tree and thank it for its beauty and strength. I connect to nature. I can watch the clouds make shapes against the sky. I know wonder. I can taste and smell and touch and hear and see what is all around me. I use my senses. I can feel my breath, fill my whole body. I tune into me. Now the water is still. I have found my anchor and everything is all right. I don't need to worry about before or after. I am in this moment. I am peace. Now I share my peace with others, and I hope that it is carried away to those who need it. And I dream. We are peace. The end. I hope that was a nice, calming final story for pajama story time. If you have your snuggle buddy, it can be your grown up, it can be a sibling, it can be a stuffy, it can be a cat. I'm gonna bug my cat for my silly lullaby right now. Come here, meow meow. Yeah, mm hmm. Get your snuggle buddy for your silly lullaby and snuggle up. Okay, are we ready for our silly lullaby? Yeah? Go to sleep, my zoodle, my fibbledy fitzy foo. Go to sleep, sweet noodle, it's time to say achoo. The chicken's in the bathtub, the closet full of sheets. The sneakers in the freezer are drifting off to sleep. Go to sleep, my zoodle, my fibbledy fitzy foo. Go to sleep, sweet noodle. The owl is whispering. And with that, we say good night from me and from Miss Wilma here. I hope you had fun at story time. We miss you guys. We can't wait to see you all again. Be sure to tune in for the rest of our story times. We're having one each day during the week. So you'll be able to see me and Miss Roche and Miss Emily reading to you all throughout the week and you never know when our cats are going to stop into the story time also. See you next time guys. Bye!